My name is Steve Anderson. And I'm Robert McLean. I've worked for NS for 22 years. I started out in CNS, but I'm currently a locomotive engineer working in Conway, Pennsylvania. Steve has two biological sons, my stepsons, and they were getting a little bit older. They were ready to move out of the house. We weren't quite done yet. We enjoyed being parents. We enjoyed the whole aspect of, of building a family. We had room in our house and our hearts and we decided to pursue adoption. And we started looking at fostering to adopt mainly. Through the process, as we started to look into adoption, we discovered that a lot of the sibling groups were split up during the adoption process. It became important to us to try to find a sibling group that, you know, maybe was at risk for being split up and try to keep them together, you know, as a family unit. I'm just really glad that us as a family didn't get separated. When they first told us that we were getting adopted, I just felt so relieved and happy. I think that was like the most happiest day of my life. We pretty much fell in love with them as soon as we saw their picture. We wanted to learn more about them. Yes, there are six of them, and yes, it was a little bit larger than what we had planned, but... We'd originally thought of maybe adopting two or three kids, but here we are five years later with six kids. <laughs> The railroad has always been supportive. My supervisors at NS during the adoption process were always very accommodating in terms of letting me use vacation time and personal time to take the adoption classes. And of course, working for NS, there is adoption assistance available. Some good advice for anybody considering adoption is to go into it with an open mind, go into it with an open heart, there's a lot of kids out there that need homes, so more and more people need to open their heart and open their mind to the whole idea of building their family that way. Every family has a story, every family has its own unique makeup. Families are composed of, yeah, biological children, foster children, adopted children, men, women, single persons. There's no true definition of, you know, what constitute a family. A family is what you make of it. Yeah, and sometimes, you know, your family member could be not related to you biologically at all and mean more to you than anybody in the world.